In this video, I'm going to demonstrate how to share files between your iPad running Interconnects and your Mac running ChronoAgent. For more information on Interconnects, visit the link below. This video assumes you've already downloaded and installed Interconnects on the iPad and that you've already downloaded and installed ChronoAgent on your Mac. If you have not yet set up ChronoAgent, check out the following video that walks you through this process. To begin, launch Interconnects from the home screen of your iPad. Tap the Share Space icon in the upper left. Tap the Add New Share Space button. Tap a remote ChronoAgent, then tap Next Step. Select the ChronoAgent Mac you wish to connect to, then tap Next Step. Now we're ready to configure the login settings to connect to the Mac running ChronoAgent. Preauthorization allows Interconnects to remember your username and password and use them to connect to the ChronoAgent Share Space. Turning this off so Interconnects prompts you for your username and password is the preferred setting when you're not the sole user of your iPad. Test the login settings by tapping Test Login Settings. Tap Next Step to continue. Enable Auto Connect to have Interconnects automatically attempt to connect to the share space upon activation or launch of Interconnects. If you're not the sole user of your iPad and are worried about security, you may want to leave this set to Off. Give the share space a local, recognizable name, then tap Next Step. Confirm your settings, then tap Save. When you view a ChronoAgent share space, you are viewing the files live on the other Mac. If you wish to store them on your local iPad, you must copy or move them to a local share space. As you can see, after copying the items to my local share space, I can now access them directly from my iPad without having to access the Mac with ChronoAgent installed. That wraps up how to share files between an iPad running Interconnects and a Mac running ChronoAgent. If you'd like to find out how to share files between multiple iPads running Interconnects, check out the following video.